Hello there, in this video, I'm going to teach you how you can generate coloring book pages like this one in Playground AI. First of all, you're going to launch Playground AI and head over to your canvas. Over here, you're going to find your generation frame. Max it out to 1024 by 1024 if that's the resolution you're looking for, or you can resize it to the resolution you want your images in. I'm going to max it out. For your prompt, you're going to just type out coloring book pages or page of animals or whatever your topic is. Let's say I want a coloring book page of an airplane. I'm going to phrase my prompt something like this and hit control plus enter and it will generate your image for you. Now that it's done generating, you can see we got a pretty good coloring book page of an airplane. Now if you want good results like this, you'll have to incorporate coloring book uh, the coloring book page in the start of your prompt then your subject and then you're going to use keywords like easy to color and thick lines maybe even marker lines and then black and white but that's optional let's change up the subject to something else and try again I'm, I'm going to draw a car instead of an airplane and hit generate now that it's time, uh, you see that we got a good result again, even after even after we changed the subject. We can try this with another one. Let's say, coloring book page of a helicopter, maybe, or a chair, and hit Control plus Enter to generate. Also, if you don't want to mess it up. Uh, you're going to want to make sure your outpainting box is away from your current image or else it's just going to draw on top of that so I'm going to move it away and hit generate again and we have our result again and it's still a pretty good current book page so if you want to you can change up the prompt add more details to it and if you just want to change your subject you're going to type out coloring book page and then after a coloring book page off and then after that is going to be your subject in the middle and in the last you're going to add keywords otherwise that sums up the video thank you for watching and goodbye